Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Today guys, we're going to review amazing, super powerful jump starter. This is probably one of the best jump starters that I've used and I've seen in my life. I'm not exaggerating. The quality is amazing, it feels great, it's super powerful and it's super easy and safe to use. So stay with us and we'll explain what it is. It's Fanti guys, uh, 20,000 milliampere hours battery. So let's go ahead, put it to the test. We're going to attempt to start that Mustang GT that has a 5.0 engine guys this is a V8 engine requires quite a bit of uh, power to be started we just purchased that one to fix it here at the shop you know we're constantly working on something for instance we rebuilt that engine on that Hyundai uh, now uh, let me just tell you a little bit about us before we start every single car we get at the garage guys we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos we take them completely apart we show you how to fix pretty much anything why simply because our mission at the shop is to save you as much money as we can all we need in return please subscribe to the channel and like the video guys now this is the gym starter let's go ahead open it okay let's come here in the shade so you can see everything with the great detail it comes packed in a box the quality of the box is super nice and smooth okay you can see it's kind of like has a 3d lettering it looks like a super fancy product guys it doesn't look like anything cheap that you probably encountered in the past Vroom, your beast up and it's going to okay include that this is the jump starter itself okay and underneath guys right here you have the accessory box okay let's go ahead and open this one one by one and i want to show you what it comes with two usb cables okay one is a usb c right here and you can see they have uh, uh with the button here so that's amazing manual is right here it will teach you how to use it step by step usb b to usb c cable as well you have the pouch okay and here is where you're going to have the clamps okay that's what's going to be connected to your car battery okay to start it now usually bmws okay mercedes german vehicles and uh, big engines like that mustang which is a 5.0 v8 engine will require quite a bit of work uh, quite a bit of power to be started the capacity of this starter is 74 watt hours you can see 2000 amp peak current guys 2000 amp now most of the batteries that i've seen even on a porsche cayenne that we have right there that's our porsche cayenne uh, with the biggest battery that i've seen it's 1000 okay 1000 uh, cold cranking amps so uh, let's go ahead okay move the remove here the sticker and this is the jump starter you have the protective layer on top uh, this is the button you just click on it okay click that button uh, okay hold it you have to hold it and once you hold it guys okay it's going to turn on show you the state of charge now if you keep holding it more okay you will turn it off now if you turn it back on you just hold it like two seconds here you have the light super bright led light with the different okay sos and emergency strokes that's where you connect the uh, cables for the jump starter on this side guys okay that's where you charge it and you can use it as a power bank to charge your phone uh, it has a usb c and regular usb as well uh, the output rating and all that stuff is listed on the back side so really really powerful product now uh, let's go ahead okay connect the cables you can see the quality feels really well made they don't feel like cheap clamps anything like that so we want to show you how dead that mustang is now it's been sitting it's wrecked guys so it's been sitting for a while probably uh, five to six months there is no power to unlock it i'll get inside okay let me just go inside and i want to show you how i will not be able to even turn the ignition on that has the smart key i'll just leave it here press the brake push on the button nothing happens so let's explain now okay what we need to do here we're going to open the hood okay let me just come on this side now perfect you can see it's smashed in the front so we're going to go ahead open it the car battery is right there in the back let's support it now because uh, we removed started taking things apart so we can fix it 5.0 v8 gt engine right here 5.0 guys let's see if that jump starter can start it you can see 
you need to connect positive to negative check the manual but it has all the protection as well if uh, reverse polarity protection and all that stuff so uh, if for some reason you mess things up okay it will fix it okay right now it says low battery you can see two uh, two volts initiated it could be under two volts so <coughs> When you uh, wait a little bit, our battery was really, really low. So now it climbed to 10 volts. It says start and uh, it's going to regulate here. It's going to show you the voltage. So uh, what I'm going to do now, guys, okay, I'm going to go um, inside and attempt to start it. Okay, so let's see if it's going to fire right up. Usually probably not supposed to be a little bit quicker, but we have technical difficulties here. Not so much room today. Okay, so let's go ahead. Press the brake pedal. Okay, it fired right up, guys, as you can see. So, now, if I go outside, let's see what it says. Ninety-nine percent, guys. Okay, and we disconnected now. So that's definitely guys a product that I would recommend. If you want to see where you can get it from, I'll put the link in the description of the video below. It's amazing, gem starter, really safe. You cannot mess things up practically. Uh, now, uh, the only thing that I encountered was when the battery was really low, I had to wait a little bit longer to uh, actually get the start going. If the battery is over two volts, you have not, uh, you don't have that problem at all, which is super simple. But when it's under two volts, sometimes you have to wait a little bit longer. So hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching and see you next time.